we made it to we are airstream so we're gonna go look at some airstreams because why wouldn't you the dogs are ready you guys ready they're ready to get out the heat right it's a million degrees here yeah so we are headed that way this is cindy's happy place i like it so much <laughs> Look at all those shiny hineys and shiny fronts. Oh, Jimmy, stop. I'll it up in here. Somebody's missing. Yeah, uh, they sold one that was here. A couple of them, it looks like. This is the one we are here to look at. This is the 30-foot flying cloud front bed office. It has that teeny tiny storage in the back. This one up front, which is pretty good sized. Open it up and show you. Very, very clean, very good sized storage. All right. And then, no storage on this side. put in but we don't have to do that and then in the back is that storage with the water underneath it all right let's go take a look well hello oh hi come on in okay what do you think? It's pretty. There's an alley in the wall right there. Well, they're going to have to knock $7,000 off for that. Yeah. That's what people get when they buy a floor model. Mm -hmm. So we'll start in the front with the, the bedroom, the queen bed. This does not come in the twins option that we're aware of. That we're aware of. New for this year is you don't have the full closets on the side. You get nightstands instead which I'm, I'm good with. Much more room that way, less closety. Same, same good cabinets that you'd expect from an Airstream. Storage under the nightstands. USB and plugs on both sides of the bed. In room to uh, put a bit of bigger bed in or lose your tablet down to the side if you, if that's the kind of person you are, and I am. So you saw this front storage from the outside. We can also get to that from the inside. And storage. This right there. needs to be turned into a big long drawer. Ooh, that'll be fun. So these are open on the sides. Oh, they're just open. There's they no are, door. There's no door. I don't but think I knew is, that. This is a door under here. And should you lock yourself out of your airstream, you could throw one of the dogs up under the That floor. would make a great dog crate. That would. Because it's always thinking. They just have their own little their own little access point. Look at that. Alright. Okay. I like it. You can see the, the room on the side there. So which means under as well. yeah. Gigi's bed could go under there. See? She's always giving me a hard time because I'm like, Gigi could fit there, but yeah, here she goes. But this time she really could. Cool. Look at Jimmy. Can I put it down now? Yeah. Hi, right, Jim. Know. Just push. Good job. Oh, oh shh. <laughs> wow. Wow. How do you make it not do that? So, shoe storage under here, or, you know, room for Gigi. But that's, that's a lot of space under there spot here to lose your keys down into the couch look at all of these storage how much room do cabinets. I have below my feet oh Cindy's trying out the bed nighty night you got a good five inches really yeah cool how's the bed well so I'm trying to imagine it me 
Greta, Jimmy, and then you. <laughs> I got plenty of room. Because that's pretty much how and it goes. And you've, you've got about five more inches yeah, on this side then, than you normally do. And then if I want to turn over, see, then I can do this. But then if I want to turn back over this way, then I have to scoot him. See. That's yeah, exactly that's, that's how, how it works. That's how my goes. <laughs> yep. Yep. That's oh, okay. it. That's it. That's how it goes. But it's not bad. Good. It's not bad. All right. I like it. Okay. There you have it. Okay. And I do not know if this is a smart TV. I will have to find out and let everybody know. But uh, storage under the under the couch. <laughs> Come on. Come on. How freaking adorable are my dogs? <laughs> oh, you guys. <laughs> storage under the planet. Doo -doo. Oh, I want my giggle sideways. There's nothing See, wrong with look, that. Look at that. That that matches pretty good. Just goes because I know this is really. See, I don't hate this because it's not. It's more blue than it is gray. Yeah. What is this? The Sierra Mist. Yeah. Is what they call it. That sounds delicious. But you know, I mean, this because this goes really well. Look at that. It does. Look how oh, pretty that would nice. look there. Yeah. Just goes really well with that. And then I think it could just really warm that up. Yes, we I pick really out do. we pick out curtains before we even buy a house. So this table is awesome because it moves around. I mean, look how far out that that could be like additional prep space for your for your kitchen prepping. Nice. And it turns. Uh, no, really. I know I brought tape measures. What? But that will turn to different angles if it's not okay. all tightened up. And of course, up and down, that's another bed. It's not turning? I couldn't. Well, I'm, I'm doing it one-handed, so. Oh, there's a here. There's a here? There's a there's a little latch right here. You just <laughs> do something with this. How does this little latch go? Oh, oh there. Oh, is it going to come all the way off? Uh, no, I, I brought it clear out here, but I couldn't get it to turn. I thought I saw it one turn. Does come home. Okay. That's nice. So you can sit like really chubby people back here. Even. So I'm good to go. Okay. So it's got a. Maybe it doesn't turn. Yeah, maybe. It doesn't look like it turns from here. I know I saw one that turned. It. Oh, there you go. You just really got. You, you got to want it. it. You really got to turn it hard. Where is it turning from? Got to be from right there. So maybe if that's like loosened up a maybe. little bit or something. Much better. Okay. Much better. So you know, just the height. See, and then this is nice. Look at this. This is nice right here. Just land right there and watch your TV shows. That's right. Watch your stories. My, my programs. Your programs. Yeah. This mm. is great. Now I will say one thing that I've heard from somebody. Don't remember who is they didn't appreciate, which I think is kind of silly, but they didn't appreciate the fact that when the doors opened, you lose some view out this window. Okay. In our, in Amelia, we lose some kitchen window, you know, mm. but I mean, so shut the door. <laughs> I mean, what do you want? The door open or to see out the window? Right. You know, you've got to, you've got to just. Look out a different window. There's plenty. There's like 17 windows, I think, in this. So. 19? I don't remember. All right, so same storage under there, and we will move to the sink. Look at that sink. Oh, I want to Cindy is going to tell you the size of the sink. Yep. Bear with. That table is. I like that table. That's like. a nice table. <laughs> I like that boulder. That is a nice boulder. <laughs> Just, just happen to have one. So, inside measurement, 15 and a half. I'm gonna say it's probably square. Yep, 15 and a half, 15 and a half. Cuckoo. That's good. Cool. Go, 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 So you know what that means. I don't. So instead of this little goomer, which, you know, that's, that's nice. Wrong with that. But our cutting board that John made, 
there. When we're not using it there, sit it right perfectly. There. It'll it'll completely cover and have plenty of room to rest there. Ah, 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 quiet. There you go. Hey, you're okay. Covered. You know what they have a cat is a dragon. Well. Oh, but that's what they all want. All right, cut. Did she offered. Let's all go to the lobby. Cindy is uh, taking care of the dog water. There's wow. actually a, a dog water bowl in the, the lounge area, the waiting area. So that's nice. That is nice. All right, so TV. I have to change that out. Let's take a look under. Look at that. That's nice. Easy to get to garbage can, which we don't have in ours. You have to fight for it. This does have the microwave and the stove oven. You can get it without the oven, get a couple of drawers there, and get the microwave convection. If we were to get it, we, we really don't care. Silverware drawer is down here. That's one thing we don't like about it is that it is down there. It'd be nice to have the silverware up here, but you can put, you know, a container up there or whatever. That's that's not deal breaker. Lots of storage. Three burner with a nice, that's the nice grill on it. I know it's not a grill, I just can't think what it's called. And then the oven you could actually, could actually cook things in, it's good enough size. Again, storage under there. Look at all this pantry, and of course, you can tell, look at all this drawer space. Oh, oh so sorry. I didn't know you were right behind me. Behind you. So let's check something here because I'm interested to know. So 22 inches deep. Of course, you got you know a little bit of the curve of a curve. You have trouble with, with curve. curve. But yeah, that's a uh, that's that's decent, right? Yeah. And fridge. Cindy's in love with the fridge. So, I am so in love with the fridge. Should we measure it? <laughs> sure. I mean, look at this. Look at this. So 13 and a half to the front of that shelf there. I mean, it's just it's just so deep, it especially is deep. the freezer. Yeah, Look that's that. a great. That is a great fridge and freezer. 17 and a half inches. Gosh. And that's I mean, that's not including, you know, that's back there. Well, this is what a 10 cubic foot. Yeah, it's the big one. The yeah. big one. So and here's your uh, I mean, that's just a deep. That's 35 inches deep. And back here is 20 inches wide, and up here is 17 and a half inches wide. Right. And do we need to know how tall? Sure. 40, 40 inches high. That's a good size closet. That's a good right size there. closet. Considering then, you also have another one. And then the four drawers below that closet oh, yeah. for you know even more space, storage. Well, and I think these Grand drawers are really too. handy due to the fact that there's not as much storage in the bathroom. Somebody poured something in the sink. There's not as much storage in the bathroom because um, there's just under here. There's no medicine cabinet. But again, I think it's easy enough that we can put a shelf up here like what we have in Amelia, right? Mm -hmm. We can put a shelf up here so we'll have storage there and then, you know, hang little things on the wall here, hang some things on the wall here. You know. And uh, the, the shelf in the shower. Automatic shower. All right, stand by. Good butt shot. 25 and a half. 28. There you go. The shelf in the shower yeah, comes off. Just comes off. So we'll show you when we get in there a little more. All right, now do the shelf thing so we're not staring at your butt while you're... Oh, because you're going to delete that. Yeah. Let's see, you don't need to sit down. Just take that out. You got a little more standing room. Got even more. Pretty nice. Pop, 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 pop. On-demand water, hot water. Is it supposed to look like that? I feel like I'm looking down the tank. But I'm not. There's, 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 a, there's a black something there. Is this the macerating toilet? Do you know? Yeah. Okay. It's a very tiny little bowl. Cool.
All right, now the really, really cool part about this. That has something to do with the toilet. It's probably the macerating. Oh, it's how you thing. flush it. Okay. So Cindy mentioned the closet. In here, you also have this closet. Do you want to you want to give some measurements for that closet? So at the bottom, again, there's the curve, but at the bottom it's 23 and a half inches deep and then 17 inches wide. Hanging rod. Roar. That pulls out. I've been informed that is not <laughs> for, desk for people to bring you lunch oh, yeah. while you're working, right? Yeah, some okay. lady does that for her husband and she's doing it wrong. That is a drawer with a drawer inside of a drawer. It's like a secret drawer. Right your pens and pencils. We just don't even have enough stuff to put in here. Meats. And then the drawer at the very bottom. Well, it's not. This isn't a drawer. This is the thing oh, that's that right. comes across. For the bed. Yeah. You and then right. that thing opens up and flips over and this whole thing makes a bed. We'll, we'll show you we'll that. We'll show you that in a minute. So this is the work area. This is a, a very nice sized cubby to put I mean, whatever you want in. Um, we also have the cable receiver and everything. Somebody said they thought they could run their Starlink in through the side and just run that over to here. That's coax. It's not going to work with your Starlink cable. Get that out of the way. USB. HDMI, of course. If you wanted to put TV here, you absolutely could. Power station. Nice. Uh, another nice storage area here. Some of the one of the older models we saw had a whiteboard up here. We don't need that. And that's fine. Okay, now somebody said that this is a soundproof curtain. I'm, what? I'm, gonna, I'm oh. gonna check it. Okay. Testing one, two, three. Testing. Can still hear you. Hmm. Well. Apparently. Okay. Maybe it's noise dampening. What about we go? I'm <laughs> not sure what's happening. I'm trying to give you. Oh, okay. Here. She's she's. That door, and then I'm opening this door. She's trying to lock me in so now, I can... can you hear me? Can you hear me now? Uh, not as well. But look, there's still a little place for Greta to get through. Right? That's that's super important because a lot of people think this is a bed. That's That would be Greta's... Greta's bench. Greta's bench because she comes and visits me while I work. And more cubby space under here. Uh, quite a bit of room. Oh, my. And a little... Uh, it's a little theater tape rope here. I'm not sure what we're <laughs> roping off. Oh, or the chair. where it goes. No, that's to tie the chair oh, down. Oh, okay, that ties the chair down over to here. Good thinking, 27. A little footrest under there. Okay, so back out to here. This is where the other bed part comes in, right? Yeah. Okay, so this comes out up here when the chair's not in the way. Well, the chair has to come out to, to do that. Yeah, you have to take the chair out okay. and open that up and that's all you can do it. That's, that's why we probably wouldn't use it. Because there's a lot of mechanics involved in making that into a bed. All right, will you? So, this piece comes out. This unfolds. And you're going to be locked in there. that. And that and has to be pulled all the way across. And that, that comes out. And, you and then you bring the cushions down, and there's two extra cushions in the bed, other bedroom. So you have that bedroom. A single bed right there. Yeah. You know, for a little, a little person. A little person, yeah. Actually, somebody laid on it and said like a six foot person could fit on it. We'll try it out one day, but not today. But yeah, there, uh, there it is. That's the 30 FB office. That's it. That's all. That's all you got. I, I think we showed him everything. My camera's hot. My wife is hot. This uh, chair's a little tough to maneuver in and out of there, but not too bad. Emergency exit, and you know what I always say. Every window is an emergency exit window if you're motivated enough. I thought you said if 
they don't find you handsome, at least they find you handy. That's it. You know what I always say, I say a lot of things. Fantastic fan here. That's fantastic. Fantastic fan here. No fan. No, I'm sorry, it's a vent. No vent in the bedroom. But you do have air conditioning vents, windows. So there's an emergency exit here and at the office. Safety first. All right, what do you think? We got a lot of little hooks in here. Put it in the truck, we're taking it home. Right? Put it in the truck! Here's the extra cushions for that bed in the office. Oh, yeah. Um, did, you, did you look in here? Yeah. Because you know, this is the only closet space in here, but I don't think it's a problem to put clothes down there by the bathroom, which is where you need them anyway. That, that is correct. You know, our clothes are convenient to the bathroom back here and in Amelia because the bathroom's right there. Well, and there, our clothes at home are in the bathroom. Right, exactly. Because that's just where, exactly. where they work. So, what modifications would you do to this? Should you get a model like this, what would you change out? Curtains. Okay, curtains. I would make new curtains because I don't like these curtains at all. They're not even the pleated ones in here. They're just the flat ones, which is really gross. Okay. Um, I know she would do the lamps. Oh yeah, change like they've out done these Amelia. lights for sure. These and then do they have the? Yeah, yeah up there is the same. And in the bedroom. I think it would be fun to do a light strip up above yeah. the cabinets so that you don't have to have these. You can have just some nice indirect yeah. lighting up there. Of course, a bigger TV. Yeah, definitely. And you could fit a good. You could put a good size TV right oh, there. Oh, and also look at this. What I noticed. So this is a typical 60 by whatever queen bed. All this yeah, extra exactly. room right here. I pointed could, out that you could really lose a laptop down there. But you could get a big, bigger mattress. For sure, you I'm could. Sorry, I didn't know you'd already noticed that. No, well, we can repeat, right? So there, oh, the puppies have been spotted by somebody out front. And they're going, because they're adorable, aren't you? All right. Now you can get packages with this model for the solar, the awnings, because it, it comes with the front awning, but it doesn't come standard with the back or side awnings. So that's an add-on package and the uh, previously mentioned microwave setup. Does anybody order a trailer without all the awnings though? I see them. Really? Out in the wild, yeah, there are people who don't. I didn't think I'd ever seen them without all the awnings. Seems crazy. Cheaper, not much. I feel like there was other stuff I was gonna measure. I don't know. Did you measure the track for what the curtain? What measure? Oh. All right, so she's got other stuff to measure. I give it to 12 paws up. What do you guys think? You're like, Dad, you already gave our paws up. Uh, yeah. It's all they think that they should be able to come in and check it out. Yeah. Not today, puppies. But we're here looking at a uh, 2024 um, 30 front bed twin office. So. A little different than the queen that we looked at in uh, Chandler. The twin is nice again with the with the extra space. The extra space, right? It's definitely nice. And then you get you get those closets. So you have closets on the end. And let's see, with the queen now, with the queen that's just nightstands on each side, no it's overhead open. cabinets. That's right. There's no overhead. And not not even any of these cabinets are there in the Queen. I don't think so. I don't so. think so because no, that gets in the way. So you really gain a lot more. Um, yeah, you do. Bedroom storage. storage. And twin. I'm guessing we have outside bins. I'm going to peek out and see. Yeah, you get you get the outside bins too. You don't, of, of course. The Queen has all the massive storage under the bed, but this is more what we're used to. So. Yeah, sure. And then all the other things that. We love about the 30s. Love, love, love. And the office space that we've talked about before. And the uh, 2024s have smart TVs. Finally, Airstream, finally. Oh, really? Yeah. Connex. 
so I'm assuming it's its own Wi-Fi thing, but I don't know. I know I've never heard of Connex. It's got to be Airstream brand, Chinese something. I don't know. Adjustable lighting. Hey, we have one of those now. A clean fan. <laughs> right. Good oh, feature. and look, this is not that same kind of weave floor that everybody's hating. Oh, this is cool. flat. And I love this. Love um, all that area for shoes because yeah, man, great. shoes are a pain in our butt. That is great. So I'm gonna go do outside storage real quick. With the you do not get these with the queen. You don't don't get the side storage. The light did that light come on automatically? Well, I don't know. I don't know how to turn. No. So that was left. Okay. On. We'll save their batteries. But you do have one of these on each side. And you still have the storage up front. And it probably comes with a free spider. Ooh, this one does. We're gonna have to keep that. Look at how different the the hitch looks. It looks, looks very different than ours. It doesn't have the, the flip, it has this latch. So let's go hit the storage in the back. So you just have this little bit in the back where the pipes run and everything. But still, that's a lot more storage than you get with the queen on the outside. And so, what is the smart plug for? Let's go take a look at the smart plug. Oh, here's another one. You gotta be smart enough to open it though. So this is where you're oh, in that for your uh, Starlink and your So it's already coaxes. got one. It's already got one evidently. So the other one's just like a big plug. massive plug. Yeah. That's so nice. That's fun. Don't have to drill a hole in the trailer like I did before. Right. So I like it. Don't know if it's in our future, but who knows?